October 17 was a crucial day for Indian democracy, a 1.4 billion populous nation. As a top court delivered a vital verdict on whether the homosexuals and other queer couples should have the right to legally marry under Indian constitution. The court refused the legal recognition of same-sex marriage and said that a legislation should be made in the parliament. The first case was filed in November 2022 by two gay couples seeking a legal recognition of same-sex marriages under the Special Marriage Act or SMB. They urged that SMB should be made gender neutral. Following this, the Supreme Court issued a notice and sought responses from the centre. The hearings lasted 10 days, were held between March and April of this year and the five judge bench reserved the judgment on May 11 over 20 petitions in total. And for this, the verdict was produced on October 17, a ruling which was tremendously anticipated. As it had the potential to generate monumental impacts on the world spectrum by a highly deemed country. While two judges supported the constitutional right of queer couples to enter into a civil union, the other three judges, forming a majority, disagreed. Let's unpack the Supreme Court judgment once more. The one thing the five judges, Chief Justice Dwight Chandrachut, Justices Sanjay Kishan Kaur, S. Ravindra Bhatt, Hima Kohli, and P. S. Narasimha agreed on was, there is no fundamental rights to marry under the Indian constitution. The court also joined the central government's suggestion to constitute a committee to examine the rights and benefits that can be given to cure couples, including rations, medical benefits, nominations for joint bank accounts, pensions, gratuity, etc. Directions to central and state governments were also meant to ensure that cure people are not denied any rights the constitution provides and no discrimination should be allowed based on gender and sexual gender. Some judges also suggested an anti-discrimination law. Another remark is that transgender persons who identify themselves as either male or female and in heterosexual relationships are allowed to get married legally under the existing laws, including personal laws. According to the petitioners, they were facing discrimination despite the 2018 judgment of decriminalizing the same-sex relations between consenting adults and so the same-sex couple equal rights as heterosexual couples in matters of marriage, adoption, secession, inheritance, surrogacy and divorce. And a major disagreement by the bench was on adoption. While two judges supported and married couples or cured couples should have the right to adopt children, the majority disagreed. What's next is in question. As the matter is now listed with the parliament, where the majority led BJP government under the incumbent Prime Minister Narendra Modi has already stated their objection on it on a batch of pleas, as the districts, the traditional Indian concept of family and marriage, which is comprised of father, mother, and their children.